Hey people, I was just talking with a guy in the grocery store about the price of food, how expensive it is to eat well. And uh, he made a, the guy at the checkout made a comment to me that, yeah, he said, you know, you get a couple apples and, uh, you know, at a dollar a pound or a dollar fifty a pound, yet you can go to McDonald's and get four chicken nuggets and be full. And, you know, basically he was saying that that's what he does. You know, as that's what a lot of people do who are just struggling to get by. You know, they're, they're going through the drive-thru, they're eating the processed fried food, uh, Mickey D's, they're going to KFC, they're going to Wendy's. And, and then he said, you know, it's kind of sad, really. I said, well, yeah, that is kind of sad. I eat a lot of potatoes, personally. Um, you can get a five-pound bag of potatoes for where I live anywhere from two dollars two dollars and fifty cents and you know potatoes are great nutrition the Irish lived on potatoes for hundreds of years as a staple of their diet filled with uh, vitamins potassium minerals and combined with milk or cheese you know you could live a long time on that very simple diet so, you know, there are ways around the problem of eating well on a very tight budget as, as food costs are rising, transportation costs are rising, fuel prices are rising, yet wages are staying the same across the board and talking with people, middle class people, I mean people that are from, whether it be teachers or are or working in the schools in some support role or even chiropractors that I've been talking with who were paid double 15 years ago than what they're being reimbursed now by the insurance companies yet the cost of living people is just skyrocketed so um, you know more and more people are having to try to figure out how to live well how to eat well and be on a pretty thrifty budget but I suggest you know don't go don't do the KFC's go for the potatoes and you know if you're creative I mean there's no way around it that to get a good piece of fish you know you're gonna pay upwards of five dollars a pound where I live on the coast those of you inland are gonna pay a lot more than that probably double for the fresh haddock that I get for five bucks a pound but you know you gotta you gotta buy what's available in your part of the country or your part of the world so just focus on that you know just regionally uh, get the foods that are most affordable for you.